गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स सो यस्टरडे वी हैव लर्न अबाउट फोर टाइप्स ऑफ कॉन्ट्री सेक्शंस दैन आई हैव एक्सप्लेन टू डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ टू डिफरेंट टाइप्स पैराबोला एंड देन आउट ऑफ फोर आई हैव डन कॉन केव राइट एंड कॉन केव डाउन सो आई हैव गिवन एन असाइनमेंट फॉर यू to uh to solve for concave left and concave up i hope you have done that assignment so make sure you do, do that assignment so if you have understood the concept of that parabola then today while we solve problem there won't be any doubt so therefore without wasting time let's start with the first question here question number 1 we need to find the vertex the focus equation of directrix equation of axis equation of lattice rectum and length of lattice rectum for the following parabolas we have i have i have chosen a three questions that a y is equal equal to 12x b x is equal negative to no and then okay so anyhow let me go with the a we have here a is y square is equivalent to 12x now as i have been Uh, telling you to understand the concept of parabola what is very important to understand the concept of parabola because as soon as you see the equation you need to find it out whether is a concave right or concave left or concave up or concave down this case y square equal to 12x is a concave right parabola so for concave right okay so just for our understanding let me write this one as a concave right if you if if you find this as a concave right parabola make sure you compare with concave right equation which is a standard form of equation y is equal, equal to 4x so now we have here y is equal left hand side we have here right hand side x then compare 4a is equivalent to 12 so we have 4a is equivalent to 12 that implies we have a is equivalent to Three. We need to find the value of a to find the vertex, focus, and everything else. But for vertex, we, usually we don't need. Anyhow, let me start solving for number one, which is the vertex. As I mentioned yesterday, this type of standard form of equation, the vertex is always at the origin. Therefore, this vertex here it is. Vertex is zero comma zero. Symbolize that one. Then number two, we need to find. focus now see i no need to draw every time focus or oh, concave right and then you mention about this focus and everything it will just waste your time and it will never improve your learning so what we have to do is always try to do with the mind calculation try to get the image of concave right first you if you know the image okay this is a concave right okay this is a fo focus and this is a directrix and if you get that image it will be much easier otherwise you will get confused later so in case of focus yeah focus in case of concave right what's the focus we have focus is a comma 0 i hope i hope you got it this one now nothing but focus is what's the value of a we have value of a is 3 comma 0 but still if you are confused and if you are not able to find it out you can just for the reference you can draw it okay okay this is a concave right okay the concave right vertex is at the origin and then focus but actually no need this will never improve your thinking if you don't use your brain you will never improve so if you just keep on writing and writing writing then you will never improve this is a mathematics subject so therefore try not to write and try to get the image in that way it will be much easier in the exam also it will be much easier so therefore now uh let's go with now number 3 number 3 we have number 3 equation of directrix so equation of directrix now this is a concave right parabola concave right parabola we have focus here then what should be equation of directrix equation of directrix is x is equivalent to negative a which implies x is equivalent to negative what's the value of a we have calculated a value is equal to 3 implies x plus 3 is equivalent to 0 that's the equation of directrix now next one let's go with the equation of x is now number 
equation of axis. So what's the equation of axis? This is a concave right. So concave right for this concave right parabola, what's the equation of axis? X axis itself is the equation of axis. So that means east it lies on the x axis, it does not lie on the y axis. So therefore you will write y is equivalent to zero. Symbol as that one. Now next one we need to find is equation of lattice rectum. Equation of lattice rectum. So now equation of lattice rectum. That will be equation of lattice rectum. Lattice rectum is a line which is a line which passes through the focus. Focus is inside the parabola. This is a concave right parabola. So if this is concave right parabola, lattice rectum is passing through A. So that means line is passing through A. So what's the equation of lattice rectum? So we have equation of lattice rectum. X is equivalent to what? A. X is equivalent to A. It's just the opposite of the directives. I told you. Directives and lattice rectum is always opposite to each other. So, therefore, we have x is equal to what's the value of a? We calculated a value is 3 implies x minus 3 is equivalent to 0. That's the equation of lattice rectum. Number 6. Uh, what do we need? Uh, last one. Length of lattice rectum. So, length of lattice rectum. In short form, you can write LLR. No problem. Length of lattice rectum is is equivalent to what? 4a. Yes or no? Length of lattice rectum is 4a. What's the 4a value? 4a value is given 12. So 4a is equivalent to 12. Then what? Units. 12a units. That's it. So we have all the points. We have your vertex, we have your focus, we have your equation of directives, we have equation of axis, and we have calculated all. Now, finally, see this is just a simple calculation that uh, we did. Now you really need to understand what you did. At the end you need to get the conclusion. That is, this is a concave right parabola. And it's a standard form of equation of parabola. Yes or no, this is a standard form where the vertex is always at the origin so this is a concave right vertex is at the origin okay no problem vertex is at the origin then what's the focus point focus point is 3 comma 0 so which means 1 2 3 so this becomes the focus point which is 3 comma 0 this is very important because solving every Tom, Dick and Harry can solve no problem. But you really need to understand what you did. What's the conclusion? What you get? Try to get the graph. Picture of the graph. So focus is 3 comma 0. Next one is what's that? Equation of directives. Equation of directives x is equal to negative 3. So that means we have here negative 1, negative 2, negative 3. Equation of directives intersecting x axis. So therefore we have here x passing through negative 3. This becomes the equation of directives. Is that correct? See, from vertex to focus 3 units and vertex to directives also is a 3 units. So distance is always equal. Now next one. Uh, equation of x is y equal to 0. So definitely it is lying on the x-axis. So x is 0. Uh, equation of lattice rectum is x is equal to 3. Equation of lattice rectum, x is equal to 3. So this becomes the equation of lattice rectum. L, L dash, oh, let me, uh, let me write D, this one is, that is D, D dash. We have L, L dash, which is x is equal to 3. The final one, length of lattice rectum equal to 12 units. Length of lattice rectum equal to 12 units. From this L to L dash is 12 units means. From this S to L becomes how much? Six units. Then similarly, this also is a six units. Six units S to L, which is a similar spectrum. Then S to L dash another similar spectrum. Six plus six will give rise to twelve units. So this is for the question number one. And then in next video session, so we'll go with the P that I have given there. Thank you.